I'm Johan Gladsen and welcome back to my channel Juice Learning. Today we are going to talk about what is digit and what is place. So let's get started. First let's understand what is digits. Digits are the symbols used to write a number. The symbols 0, 1, 2, 3, up to 9 are used to write numbers and hence they are called as digits. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, up to 9 are called single digit numbers. 10, 11, 12, 13, up to 99 are called as two digit numbers. 100, 101, 102, 103, up to 999 are called as 3 digit numbers. Now let me make you understand with some examples. First let us take a look at my first example that is 4926. In this example, what are the digits in this number? Just remember that the digits are the symbols used to write the number. So the digits are 4, 9, 2 and 6 because these are the symbols used to write the number. Now let us move on to my other example that is 54,316. In this example, what are the digits in this number? The digits are 5, 4, 3, 6 and 0 because they are the symbols used to write this number. And so we can identify how much digit number is this? This is a 5 digit number because there are 5 digits in this number. Now let us take a look at my last example that is 8,91,436. In this example, what are the digits in this number? The digits are 8, 9, 1, 4, 3 and 6 because these are the symbols used to write this number. Now we have understood that a digit is the symbols used to write the number. So the symbols used to write a number are called as digits. Now let's move on to the next topic that is place. Now you may be thinking, how is digits related to a topic? Well, let me explain you by telling what is place. As I told you before, digits are the parts of a number. And as you have seen before, those digits have been put into a particular place. Those particular places have a different name. Let us take a look at each of them one by one. Let us first take the example of 93,411. In this example, the first place 1 has 1 space. The second, 10 space. Third, 100 space. Fourth, 1000 space. A fifth, 10,000 space. But if you add one more digit, let's say 6, then which place will it be? Well, it will be in lakh space. Now, let us take a look at the other example. That is 76,040. In this example, 4 is in the 1's place, 1 is in the 10's place, 0 is in the 100's place, 6 is in the 1000's place and 7 is in the 10,000's place. So, now for the last example, let's do it. It's the number is 3,80,432. So, which number is in the last place? 3. So, let's put 3 here in the last place. Now, which number is in the 10,000's place? It's 8. So let's put 8 over here. Now which number is in the thousands place? It is 0. Now which number is in the hundreds place? It's 4. So let's put 4 here. Now which number is in the tens place? It's 3. So let's put 3 over here now. And last of all, which number is in the 1's place? It is 2. So let's put it over here in the 1's place. So now 
we have understood what is play. So now let us learn to play these numbers according to their place. Now let's look at the black space. Three is in the black space. So it will be called as three lakh. Now let's look at the ten thousand space. Eight is in the ten thousand space. But let us also look at the thousand space. It is zero. So now we have to read them together. You have to not eight ten thousand zero thousand. Not like that. You have to read it together. So it will be eighty thousand. Now let us look at hundred space. Four is in the hundred space. So we will read it as four hundred. Now let us take a look at the ten space. Three is in the ten space. So we will read it as thirty. Now in the one space it is two. So we will read it as two only. Now let us read it together. Three lakh eighty thousand four hundred thirty two. Now we have learned what is digits and what is space. Hope you understood this concept. In my next video, I will be talking about place value and face value. If you didn't subscribe to my channel, please subscribe now and also enable the bell icon to get notifications on my latest videos. Bye for.